you must double your efforts. Islamic group tells Buhari, defend Pantami. The Bauchi state chapter of the Jamatsu is Alatil Bida, popularly referred to as Izala, has called on the federal government to urgently tackle the current spat of insecurity in every part of Nigeria deceitfully. The religious organization made a call in a statement signed by its state chairman, Paris Dagaba Azan, and made available to, to journalists in Bauchi, adding that the central government should also decisively deal with questionable characters who have never eaten their desire to see the failure and disintegration of the country. JIBWIC urged the federal government and security agencies to double their efforts in confronting various security challenges facing the country and advised that intelligent gathering be given priority attention. We call on the federal government and security agencies to double their efforts in the areas of confronting the various security challenges being faced by the country. Issue having to do with intelligent gathering should be accorded serious attention, as unstated. Meanwhile, the group asserted that the allegation being leveled against the Minister of Communication and Digital Economic, Dr. Isa Ali Pantami, is an attempt to pull him down despite the giant stride he recorded in Nigerian communication sector. The minister's alleged link with the terrorist group, Al Qaeda, according to GIBWIS, was being targeted at President Modibuari, declaring that it was nothing other than the pursuit of the sheer hatred, grudges, and ill will be nursed against the president itself. Azan stated that GIBWIS noted with dismay that the pull him down war being waged against Dr. Pantami in his current position as a senior member of President Modibari's cabinet is nothing other than pursuit of the sheer hatred, grudges, and ill will being nursed against President himself. He further stated that the allegations were alleged and leveled by both known and hidden enemies of the administration who have from the world go and never missed any opportunity to express negative, low, and mischievous options about government to the extent of openly supporting agitations and attempts to bring the whole system down. So basically, the president's campaign of calumny, blackmail, and hatred against the truly patriotic performing and Responsive, responsible Dr. Isa Ali Pantami, as is actually in furtherance of the agenda urged, urged a long ago to do everything possible to discredit the present administration. Thank you for listening to this news. Hmm. You can imagine. It's minority. Islamic group in the in Nigeria practicing religious of senselessness. <laughs> that question needs to be asked. Need to, we need to ask President Buhari and Pantami that question. Pantami is his accusa accusations are really verifiable. Himself did not even deny it though. He gave excuse which does not even make sense to me. I don't know to others. It's high time we put religious bigotry aside and work together as a nation. Yes, and work together as a nation. If he is not a Muslim, the narrative would definitely change. Many Muslim groups behave like potential terrorists in the ideology. That's what they are misbehaving. To me, I think Nigeria is not a nation. Point of correction is not a nation. The worst government since the creation of Nigeria is the, this government that we are into. It's the worst. 
problem upon problem upon problems. The problems that we have have not been solved. Another one is coming in. You can imagine. Another one is coming in. Eh? Why supporting and sympathizing with terrorist sympathizers? This is what brought calamity into Nigeria because we are supporting sympathizing sympathizers. Those are, that are sympathizing with terrorists. Thinking that you people are propagating Islam. Don't know that you are destroying the country. You can imagine. Support your dis distribution of debt to Nigerian Islamic religions that destroy Nigeria. Terrorists supporting terrorists. And you talk about this, this discredit. What is, where is what is the credit and where is it? You can imagine. Pantami admitted that he, he, he said sometimes something like that. He admitted that he said, what are we saying? That ignorance is not an excuse in the law. Yes. For God's sake, he should resign honorably. I meant Buhari. Or he be replaced by another person. The president's administration has offered nothing to Nigeria but terrorism. They have offered terrorism, banditry, kidnapping, nepotism. That is worry for you. Nepotist, nepotistic governments. Nepotistic presidents. You can imagine. You can imagine. This so-called man did not even deny the so-called allegations. So what are you all senselessly saying? It's very obvious. The handwriting is very boldly written on the wall. Boldly written on the wall and we're not seeing the truth. We are being covered. We are being blinded by uh, 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 position. We are being blinded by money. You can imagine. We blinded by money. The religious organization made a call in a statement signed by its state chairman, Barisagab Azan, and made available to journalists in Bauchi. Adding that the central government should also deal with questionable characters who have a, a never hidden their, their desire to see the failure and distinction of the country. So, viewers, with or without the help of the government, Nigeria is not a country. Nigeria is not a country. Nigeria can become a country with the help of God. So, drop your comments below the comment box. Thank you.